confidence. Today I am going to develop a video for this comment. Sir, please help me out with the coding which only limit martingale to two steps only after two regular failure it restarts. And I see same um, request is here. How to put a stopper example if it fails five times in a row, it will stop and go back to the initial state. Uh, this is when meaning and when meaning how to stop and this comment uh, when losing when martin killing how to stop so i will show both in this video first i'm going to binarybots.com you can find the link in the video description okay from here if you don't have an binary.com account you can create otherwise you can log into the account by clicking here i am logged into the binary bot platform you can even develop this in binary d bot derived bot platform also i am logged into the binary.com bot platform for my this development Okay, first I do is I will reset this bot. Then I will change the marker to synthetic indices. Ultimately, telling index. Then I will keep up, down, and rise for the same as here. And I will delete this third code block. I don't want this for this tutorial. Then first I will create a variable stake and take it here and connect it here and I will add one for this stake and I will just connect this variable stake to stake. Okay, what I need to do is uh, now I want to do martingale first thing is martingale on limit martingale to two steps only after two regular failure it will restart okay i will add martingale this i will create i'll go to logic then take this if code block and connect it to fourth code block then if if i want if result is being if result is in what I need to do is set this take to same as here, then I will right click on this code block and duplicate it and connect it here. Then I will click this settings button and connect else code block. Then I will go to variable and get this stake. Then I will click on math and take this code block. Then I again go to variable, take stake and connect here. And I will multiply by martingale factor 2.1 and then 2.1 and then any So martingale is done, but our requirement is to stop the martingale after two consecutive losses and start with initial step. So what I need do here is I will get a variable to count the losses. I will then is count loss. Then if result is loss, change count by count loss by one. If result is win, set count loss to zero. I'll connect it. Then this variable will count the number of losses. Then I again go to logic and take this if variable and connect it here. What I need to do is if count loss if count loss equals to 
here he mentions two regular losses so i will enter two here but you can enter any number here if count loss is three what we need to do is we want to set count loss to zero i will duplicate this and connect it here then i want to do the set state to initial state and i duplicate this and connect it here else if count loss is not greater than two then do this multiple multiplication martin again okay let's let's test this one loss martin again Two loss now it should start from one dollar again. Okay, it's okay. Again, mounting there. Last again, start from the one dollar. Okay, let's change this to three and let's check. one new then one last martin gave one time last then it should martin gain again yes correct it is martin gaining three times then now if this Mean again go back to initial state and if this is lost this should go back to initial state then i'll consider this correct then our next requirement is now we added three times if martingale now we added to step regular failure but to restart then here this comment is for when it is winning five times how to stop and go back to initial state so what we need to do is uh, i'll create another variable count win then i'll check i'll take this code and connect it here change count win by one then i'll take the variable again at if result is lost, that count will be zero. Okay, then what we need to do is logic if as same as earlier. If Counting if counting equal five, what we need to do is set this state to one and set counting into zero. Then else. Else, if result is win, set the state to one and count loss to zero. Let's run this mode and check. For now, I will clear this old data and I will change this count into three. We stop this video quickly.
since the initial stake of this bot is one we will not be able to identify when this is reset after three wins so i will change here to one point two then we can identify if this is win the stake will change or not Okay, after three consecutive wins, now the initial stake should be 1.2 and it's 1.2. Then this code block also working. So this is the code blocks for these two comments. Now let's check these bots are working in dbot platform also. I will click the save button here and download. Then I'll name it as trade limiting bot. Okay, you can download this pod block by go to this learn pad. Here yeah, you can see code blocks and here also you can see code blocks you can download from here. Again I will go back to probability box website. Then I will log into debug platform. Okay, then I will drag and drop this develop code block to the debug platform. Okay, let's see whether this is working here. Yes, no issue. This part is working in debug platform also. So that's it about these two comments. And if you have any questions like this you can comment here. Thank you very much for watching this video.